as we were covering this historical winter outbreak and as Dr. Dessler mentioned, you may have heard meteorologists mention the polar vortex. The polar vortex is a persistent normal circulation located above the Arctic. And in the wintertime, temperatures here can reach as low as 50 degrees below zero. And every now and then the tight circulation of the polar vortex will actually weaken and that allows for frigid Arctic air to spill south into the United States. When the weakening of the polar vortex is significant enough, we'll get Arctic air here in Texas. And that is exactly what happened in February. But here's the catch and something to consider. There have been hypotheses, hypothesis that that the Earth continues to warm because of climate change. And as it does so, the polar vortex may weaken more often. This would mean more frequent extreme cold outbreaks in the lower 48 and potentially in Texas. But as Dr. Dessler mentioned, the link between climate change and the polar vortex is complicated at best. And so we'll just have to wait and see over time if those two things can be linked together.